at the stage live with Fat Moth from St. Catharines, Ontario. We're in the beautiful Goddard, Ontario, having these dudes. Thanks, guys, for coming. Thanks for having us. So we heard your first song in the last episode, and we want to get behind the music in this one. The cool. writing process, there's seven of you, so there has to be some sort of process, I'm hoping, right? How does yeah. that work with seven? Yeah, a lot of the times I'll, I'll bring kind of like the foundation of a song to the band, at least in like with the previous album and the one we're working on. And uh, it really just adapts and change, changes from there. Like it's a really open kind of creative space where uh, there's no strings attached and every idea is a good idea to try out. So they're an awesome group of people just to create with and it's mm -hmm. always uh, refreshing to get different perspectives on what you could create together. Amazing. So I've had a 16-piece band here. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> and so that's, like, you know, that's even bigger. But the fact that there's seven of you, and if you're all bringing in a music, like, you know, your, your own take on a song, your own vibe, like, how does that work? Like, you collectively just, you sit down and you think about what you're doing? Or is it, like, a few people that are the, 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 the like, you know, the, the writers? Right, yeah, it sort of works for us, like uh, the singers will get together and some of like the, the guitar players will, we right. live together as well. Oh, well that helps. And, uh, there you and go. And with our drummer here, so we just kind of get to jam a, a lot. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Which is awesome. That is so awesome. And uh, yeah, we sort of like get together with the rhythm section sometimes, we get together with the singers and then work on them individually and then bring them together All with right. the full band practice. All right, well, what's the song that we're going to hear next? Uh, it's called Lee Baby Sims. Yeah, is there, is there a story behind that? Is there something that, uh, you know, maybe you could tell the audience how you got to that, uh, that song? Sure, something unique? sure. Yeah, so um, Lee Baby Sims is a character in a film called Down by Law. Um, the character's played by Tom Waits, and he's sort of a rundown radio DJ, and uh, he gets convicted of a crime uh, that is worse than what the crime that he actually did, uh, which basically meant driving a car across town uh, that was stolen, and then he got pulled over and there was a body in the trunk. So the movie sort of proceeds and he's in jail. But uh, so I kind of did like a localized retelling for us. We're from Niagara. And uh, it's just a character who goes to the Niagara Falls Casino and tries to cross the border into the <laughs> States and gets busted for having a body in the trunk. Oh my God, I love it. Awesome. Well, let's hear it. What do you guys think? You want to hear it? Yeah.
scream for ice cream. I'm not guilty of that crime. I was set up on that your guy. I didn't put that man in the trunk. I can't be straight out too drunk. Woo! Thank you. Wow. That was amazing, guys. Very theatrical, wouldn't you say? I felt like I was in the moment with that man, I swear. So good. Circus-like, too. I, like, there's a lot of elements there. Wouldn't you say? Wouldn't you guys say? Yeah. Yeah, it was great. So Thank good. So much. Thank yeah, you. yeah, yeah. And I love the background story of the Tom Waits movie, and <laughs> you just had to create something just like that. That's pretty cool. Well, it's just fun to, you know, to get to tell a tell a story that's already been written and kind of change it and make it your own and yeah it's your interpretation on it yeah absolutely well i enjoyed it it was awesome well thanks guys for joining us today we're gonna have one more episode with fat Mo mouth moth oh my goodness blah 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 fat <laughs> moth and uh, they're gonna be back with um a little q a for the audience let's see how that goes bye